We are just eight days away from the annual Brainerd JC's Ice Fishing Extravaganza at Hole in the Day Bay on Gull Lake. Tonight, Clayton Castle gives us a preview of the annual Brainerd Lake Staple. It's back. For the 28th year in a row, the Brainerd JC's Ice Fishing Extravaganza will take over the Hole in the Day Bay next Saturday, the 27th. The annual event is circled on many calendars for months out because of the fun and the giving back to the community. The largest charitable fishing tournament on the face of the planet. Uh, we raise a bunch of money, have about 10,000 of our best friends out on the ice to help us raise money, and we give it all back to charity, um, up to 50 different charities in any given year. Along with the big ice fishing tournament, there are other small competitions one can take part in to win some cash. One would be the catch of the day, which is uh, we'll announce a mystery fish the day before the contest and if you happen to catch that biggest mystery fish and have the five dollar add-on sticker for the catch of the day um, there's a ten thousand prize dollar prize package that goes along with it and it's not just the adults who can have fun there is something for everyone at the largest event of the year for the jc's we have kids events at center ice starting at 11 o'clock so you can come out and do the kids on ice olympics and maybe take home some prizes for that um, and come on out and help support local charities. Crow Wing County Sheriff Todd Dahl, who is retiring in 2018, is sentimental when thinking about the annual event and the impact it has had on the community during his time in office. It's a great thing, great cause. Uh, they make a lot of money for our area, um, charities in the area, and the JCs do a great job. This is, you know, it's not a new thing. You know, when you're talking, I think, 28th year now, um, it, it's turned out to be a, a real good thing for everybody involved. After raising close to $20,000 last year for local charities, signs are pointing towards raising even more in 2018. Sales are really on par or even a little bit better than they have been in the past for, for at this particular point. We had a really, really great November. On average, the ice fishing extravaganza has attracted over 10,000 people annually for over 20 years. Reporting in Nisswa, Clayton Castle, Lakeland News. Now parking will be available for the event at Brainerd International Speedway, where a shuttle will take you to the lake. For more information on the event can be found at www.icefishing.org. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.